Hey everyone's Jackal Wolf back in all of the mod six to the sky with another five minutes. That's how I did it. Now, if you've been following along, you know that last time we were working in the quest book, we did the X Nilo page. We got ourselves the from the beginning, which was to collect ourselves a piece of wood, and we did the simply cobble, which was to collect ourselves a piece of cobble. This episode, what we're going to focus on is the I am not a crook. Oh wait, the there's an infestation, and then ultimately the strung for strings, which is going to involve us getting a bed. Now, getting a bed is a very very important goal in all of the mod six to the sky because this is a 1.16.5 mod pack, and that means there are phantoms and the long that we don't sleep, the better chance that we are could get attacked by phantoms, which is not great when we are in a pretty open world as it is. So before we start that, we're going to need to get ourselves some dirt, and then we're going to create ourselves a tree farm. We're going to infest those trees with the silk worms. We're going to get the string, and we're going to make that bed. Now, as I said last time, this version of Skyblock starts us with a four by three by three uh island of dirt, which is very, very handy. So to start, I'm going to go, I'm going to take out these two layers of dirt. I'm going to leave the top one because of the grass and the bottom one just for now, uh, simply because I don't want to accidentally lose any dirt out of it. Something to keep in mind is there is also a block of bedrock here. I've got a feeling we're going to need to use it in the future, but for now is just simply good enough for us just to leave that there. Now, to make a good tree farm, we're going to want to expand out our base a little bit. I am using the half slabs of stone. It's not part of the quest line, but we can make ourselves a building wand. It's a very, very simple building wand. It is two sticks and a piece of cobblestone gets us the stone wand. Maximum nine blocks. That means maximum nine blocks range. So this is currently... This is currently seven blocks wide. So if we were to hover over there, you can see all of those blocks kind of appear in that uh, preview. We click on that, it automatically fills it in. I absolutely love building wands. They are a great, great tool, especially in a skyblock world. Something that was missing from Sky Factory 4. Uh, something I'm going to say every single time because it is 100% true. So to make my tree farm though, I'm going to go build out in this direction and then we're going to fill in some dirt every now and again. I want to keep the trees a little bit spaced apart because right now we are mostly focused on getting some leaves. In the future, we may want to move those blocks of dirt in so we can kind of focus on getting wood. It really depends on, you know, what resource you are trying to go for. But we're going to need leaves now and we're going to need leaves in the immediate future. Alright, so there is my building wand broke, but that's okay. We were pretty much as far as we we're going to go anyways. Let's just make a couple more slabs and we're going to go fill this in. So that is step one. We're going to go take the saplings. I've only got three on me. These are from the original tree. We're going to go one, two, three, and now we get to do our fun little twerk dance. All right, perfect. So as you can see, I've got a little bit of an overlap with the leaves. You can make these a little bit wider. It's really going to come down to how much building space you got, how much time you want to put into building it. If I'd gone four spaces in between, I think we would have been okay. They wouldn't have been overlapping. Overall, though, I'm still going to get quite a few leaves compared to the amount of wood that I get. So, like I said before, our very, very first quest is the I Am Not a Crook quest. That is to craft ourselves a wooden crook. Now, this is very, very simple. It is four sticks in a crafting table in a L shape. We can go make that L shape in the other direction, but we can't go down at the bottom. It's got to be off at the top. So, we're going to go take our wooden crook. There's our quest complete. Perfect. Let's go open up that quest book. We'll click on that. I am not a crook rewards. We've got a shiny pink crook and then we also got a random reward. Now these can be very, very helpful. You can see we can get four nether wood saplings, 64 bone meal, 16 dirt, 64 cobblestone, and then a bunch of different saplings, which 
the saplings themselves probably don't make that big of a difference right now. But if you want to build something with a particular type of wood, it's probably the easiest way of getting them. So we'll click on our random reward. We got birch saplings. So that's actually kind of cool. I, I like birch. Birch is a pretty good uh, building material. But for now, we're just going to go keep working with the oak saplings. So the other reward we got from that was the shiny pink crook. Now that is an enchanted crook with unbreaking one on it, which is really, really good. What we can do, just as an example, with the wood crook, we can go vein mine. That is the tilled or the grave key held down. You can see it highlights everything that's going to break. We break that. We get a bunch of apples, we get a bunch of sticks, we get a bunch of saplings. Using the crook increases the chance of those dropping. Now the shiny pink crook, which has the unbreaking on it, we can do the exact same thing. And you can see it hardly went down at all, so we're going to get a little bit more use out of it than we did out of, do out of the regular wood ones. But it is an enchanted one, it will eventually break, we don't want that, we're going to have to keep that nice and safe. Now we also got the Punisher last time. That was a quest reward. So we're going to go clean up this wood. And then we're going to go replant all of these saplings. Now from here, you can keep doing that to your heart's content to get as much wood as you need, as many saplings as you need, as many apples as you need. They are going to be a good early food source. But one of the things we just picked up was these silk worms. Now the silk worm is something that we need to use to get string in our world. We can actually cook these as a food source or we can go and we can start placing them on leaves and it will slowly start spreading an infestation to all of the leaves that are co uh, connected to these. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna place the rest of these down and actually let's twerk up a couple more trees. That way we can get a whole bunch of string right off the bat all that's left for us to do is just wait for all of these leaves to turn white and then we'll be good to go. So that's looking to be pretty good. I think that is completely done. We're going to go vein mine and you see the only thing we got was string and then more of those silkworms, which is again, a good food source, again, early game food source, but the string is really what we're going for. And it did break our initial wood crook, but that's okay. We've got this backup one. And we now got ourselves a bunch of string. So if we go open up that quest book again, we got the, there's an infestation quest that was getting the silkworms. So we get a reward of those cooked silkworms. And then we also get another random reward, which it's going to give us bone meal. Now this is a good reward for the future. We will need some of this later on, but we're going to leave that one alone for now. Oh, look at that. There's a couple up here that I missed. Can I get you? There we go. And it's stuck at the top. So we can just use an ax and there we go. So last quest for the day, we're going to go back into the quest book. That is going to be the strung for strings quest. We've got the string already. Now what we're going to do is make ourselves a white bed. As a reward, we're going to end up getting a bed roll. Now the bed roll is like a portable bed. It is actually really, really cool. You just don't set a spawn with it, which in a skyblock world, it might make sense when you go off adventuring, but uh, for the most part, you could be so close to your bed anyways, it's not going to make a big difference. So to do that, we got to go into our little crafting table here, and then we need to take four string three times to get us our three white wool, and then we just need the three wood. There is our standard vanilla white Minecraft bed. There you go. Strung for strings quest is complete. And let's go throw down. We got three more slabs. Let's go use two of them. We're going to make the bed. It's now nighttime. It's going to sleep. We're going to wake up. We got zero phantom problems. So now we're going to go open up that quest book. Click on the quests. There's our backpack or not our backpack. There's our bed roll, which is really, really good. And when we're out and about, we can place it down sleep in it. We can't do it right now because it's not nighttime, but then we can just break it and keep carrying it with us. It's super, super simple. Very, very nice. Very, very easy. But you know what? That's going to be it for this one, guys. Next episode, we are going to go and start working on the time to grind, the gravel, the sand, and the dust. And from there, we're going to go and move on to the sifting. But if you enjoyed this video, though, please think about leaving a like and a subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter at Jackal. 
Wolf. Also, check out the description below. There will be a link to my Discord page. I would love it if you guys stop by to say hi. As well, there will be a link to my Patreon page. If you enjoy this channel, if you enjoy this content you want to support, stop by, check it out. There are a lot of great perks out there for all of my supporters. As well, I've been streaming on Twitch, JackalWolf77. I stream Tuesday nights, Friday nights, and Saturday nights, 8 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. If you're looking for an opportunity to chat with me, that is a great chance to do that. But that is it. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.